Guy Captain's run's done. How are the boys feeling? Yeah, the boys are really excited. Um, we know we won our best last week. Credit to Worcester, they put in a very good performance. But um, look, we're just excited to, to get back out on the pitch and show what we're really about this weekend against Sale. It's been a tough week. There's no questions about that. What's been the actual mood in, in, at Oval Park? The mood is still pretty good among the boys. Um, we're not in the worst of positions, but we're not happy with the start and and what the, the Tigers fans expect from us. So what we need to do is just make sure that we get on the pitch and show what we've been working on in training, make sure that our mood stays upbeat and make sure that we're positive and bring a hell of a lot of enthusiasm for the game. Without giving away any secrets, how do we beat Sale on Sunday? So it's all about physicality to start with up front. We have to make sure that we're on top of our game and then we've got a great set of backs that can, they can put anyone to the sword. So without giving too much away, it's just going to be a, a very, physical door, a phys, very physical battle up front. And we have to make sure that we're ready for sale. And yourself, how are you settling in? It's been a month now, enjoying the game? Yeah, I'm absolutely loving it here. Um, it was a big change, uh, took me out of my comfort zone a little bit, but I'm, I'm massively happy that, that I made the move and, and I'm really enjoying myself here at Leicester. Jordan, George Ford, uh, of course, Tom Youngs, Mark Bakewell, all the senior figures have been really vocal this week. What's been the message? Yeah, and I think that, that just says what they are as characters and leaders within our squad. Uh, they've stepped up this week and they've put a few things in place and, and they've kind of told us in no, no frank terms exactly what's expected to be a Leicester Tigers player. At the moment, it hasn't been good enough. Uh, we have to look at ourselves, no excuses. We have to improve and we will this weekend. A couple of young guys have stepped up as well over the last few weeks with injuries. How do you think they're settling in? Yeah, look, I was massively impressed with the, the Tigers Academy here and about how many good boys uh, are looking to break through in the first team. There's a lot of lads that haven't had the opportunity yet, but, but they will get it soon as well. And the boys that have stepped up are playing well. Look at Ben White starting at nine this week. Big things to come from him. And, and as a squad, uh, we're, we're here pushing them through and, and we know they're capable of doing the job. Finally, it's empty now and it's a little bit daunting when it is empty, but this stadium <laughs> can get roaring when it needs to. How much do we need the fans behind us? Yeah, this stadium is unbelievable. The fans are the superb. And even last week in patches, they, they really do drown out the opposition and they drown out... Um, uh, they drown out other decisions and things. So what we really need this weekend is the Tigers to bring the roar, the, all the fans cheer the boys on and, and we'll give them an 80 minute performance.